Okay, so I uh, just thought I'd do a little update. Today uh, has been, it's been in the mid to low 50s during the day. And uh, we're just, uh, or I'm just on my way. We've got the uh, driver and uh, Bo who works with us. we got uh, 70 barrels of buckwheat honey going out. Yeah, so we got to go get that truck loaded. And then uh, tomorrow, it's supposed to be in the 50s again. And we're going to go look for dead outs. Because it's hard to believe we're only four weeks away roughly from sending our bees down to California. Just mind-boggling. Um, and so we're going to go check for dead outs and uh, also do an oxalic acid treatment. Uh, this is kind of the time of the year where they're going to be the most broodless because gearing up for California, we are going to start stimulating them with pollen sub to start rearing brood. So while they're kind of still winding down, uh, the winter solstice still hasn't happened. So the day, the daylight still gains shorter. So the bee, soon as uh, the winter solstice takes place and the days start getting longer, sunlight wise, uh, the bees sense that and they start gearing back up. So uh, we want to take advantage of that and uh, treat them and get them all ready so there's been some people asking me you know what can I do with my bees this time of the year and it's sort of an unnerving time because you know I mean it's uh you know we haven't been in our bees for oh gee whiz I don't know a month and a half two months and uh so every time there's a really mild sunny day it always thrills me to actually see bees flying you know because it's like oh they're they're still alive yay uh, but yeah, I mean if it, if you get a day that's in the low 50s, you know, there's not a lot of wind or anything It doesn't hurt to pop the lid and take a look um, If they're clustered on the bottom, you're having a hard time seeing them uh, You can always put your ear if you're brave enough put your ear to the top of the hive and knock on the side and uh, you can listen for the buzz But anyways, so that's kind of the update for now um, enjoy three four more weeks of uh, at least on our part we're going to enjoy three or four more weeks of not having to actively be uh, involved managing the bees and uh, and then get back into the swing of things so anyways hope your bees are doing well and uh, yeah in the meantime too if you have any questions or curiosities uh, just just ask them in the comments and uh, I'll, I'll try my best to get around to them and uh, anyways yeah so and just uh, see for the record book I'm not I'm not touching my phone so as far as I know this is uh, this is okay to record this way even though I probably haven't exactly done myself a service by bringing attention to that see you soon There is my job, gotta load that truck.